What is up everyone? Welcome to the Charge Arms YouTube channel. It is Char. I am the founder and creator of Charge Arms. Welcome to our channel. I'm so glad that you are all here. And now that you're here, you may as well just subscribe and turn on post notifications and follow and do all that fun stuff because I know you guys are going to be here for a while. Today we are going to be going over what exactly is Charge Arms? What is our mission? What is our goal? Who am I? Like, why did I even start this company? And then of course we're going to go over how to use Use your charge harms when you do decide to buy them. It's a lot of fun. Delicious. To start off, my name is Char and I created Charge Arms about a year ago. So September of 2021. It's crazy. It's been like a full year since we've launched and it's been just a wild journey. But I just graduated from U of I and now this is like my little baby that I am doing and growing it to the top. Today we're just going to get into how Charge Arms even works. Maybe you're curious about Charge Arms. You saw it online. You're like, I don't, what is this? I'm going to go over it step by step with you. If you order exactly what you're gonna have to do. This is assuming that you're gonna be putting Char Charms on your water bottle. If you're gonna be putting it on your water bottle, you're gonna need to buy a water bottle a hook. We have more than a dozen shapes and sizes and different colors. And every single water bottle hook pretty much looks like this and has a tiny little hook. And then on the back, there's going to be an adhesive. And this one is a red adhesive. Most of the time it's gonna be red, sometimes it's clear. The second thing that you'll probably need to get are some accessories. So we have a ton of different charms. Check them all out. I know it's a lot to go through. And also we have AirPod cases. So if you are like a gym gal or you just love to have your AirPods with you everywhere, it's very helpful. So you're gonna need to get the hook and then you're gonna need to get several accessories. I recommend at least like two. Um, I would not put more than like four or five accessories on one water bottle at a time. And if you want to order more accessories, that's why we have our zip pouch. Like put your accessories in there when you're not using okay, them. So I'm going to show you guys exactly how to use Charge Arms, how it works, and how you're going to put it together once you receive it in the mail. So this is what you're going to do. First, you get your water bottle. This is one of the ones that we sell. We sell the matte tumblers. I love these. However, you can absolutely use Charge Arms on any water bottle that you have. I'm going to take my cute water bottle hook and I'm going to peel the red backing off of it. Sometimes it can be a little tough. I recommend just going from a corner and working it off like that. If you need to use tweezers, like totally fine. Go ahead and just grab some tweezers to use. I'm going to recommend that you put this on the upper part of your water bottle. So I'm putting it pretty close to the top. That's where I recommend. I have seen people put it in the middle. I don't recommend putting it at the bottom and I don't recommend putting it up here, but around this area, it's going to be your best bet. I also think that you don't only have to put one hook on. On this water bottle, this is like my go-to daily water bottle. I have two hooks. Or I'll do AirPods and keys on one. Sometimes I'll switch it up. It's just like I like the extra convenience of having two hooks. So if you want to have two hooks for like extra cuteness and like extra ability to add charms, do it. Once your hook is on, you are going to add your accessories. Today we're just going to be working with a purple marble chapstick holder. Love this one. It's one of our most popular chapstick holders. And it's super simple. You literally just open up this clip and clip it on. Easy. And then you can add as many other accessories as you want. This is our new purple flower bead charm. I'm gonna be adding this one on here. Sometimes I like to add pom-poms. However, the caveat to adding a pom-pom onto charge arms is that you should put it on the very bottom. So I put it on the bottom because then it doesn't like cover all of your charms. It like kind of goes in the back and then your charms stay in the front. That is how you use your char charms. The biggest question that I get is how can I wash this? Like that's not sanitary. Yes, it is. All you're going to have to do is remove your charms. You keep your hook on, whether you want to dishwash or hand wash. Hand washing is always going to be just like less abrasive and more gentle. So I would recommend just hand washing your water bottles in general. If you're in a rush and you need to put it in the dishwasher, totally fine. Just make sure you take off all of your accessories. I know I'm not the only one who does like a lazy wash here and there. If I have like just like a bead charm on, I'll just open it up, swish it around a little bit, and the bead charm can get wet. But I know I'm not the only one that does that, so that's why I'm putting that out there. The other question that I get is how do you take the hook off? This one's really simple. First of all, the hook is not gonna damage your water bottle. Whether your water bottle is like ceramic or metal or plastic, it won't damage it, but there's two ways to take it off. 
The first way that you can take the hook off is just by peeling it off with your fingers. What I'll do instead is I will grab a credit card or like a gift card or something and just shove it in between the hook and the water bottle. And then it just comes right off. Since I just put this one on, like it can come off pretty easily. This water bottle, this blue hook has been on here for months. I would definitely be using a credit card or a gift card to take this off because it is pretty stuck on there. This one I just put on, so if I tried to peel it off, it would, I could probably just do it with my fingernails. These hooks are not meant to like come on and on and off. Once you take it off, that's it. You're done with that hook. So like, don't expect to put it back on if you take it off. So in every order, there's going to be an instructions guide and it's gonna look something like this. And in this guide, it says, decide where you want your hook. Once you put it on, you cannot move it. Well, make sure you remember this and when you are putting your hook on, you are happy with where it's at and you're not gonna wanna move it. Our hooks are not that expensive. So I would recommend just getting a couple, like get a two pack, get a three pack, get 10. If you want to move water bottles or if you wanna use it on multiple water bottles or you think you might wanna move it in the future, you have extras. If you're debating on buying charge harms, here are the reasons that you should buy charge harms. The first things first, it's gonna make hydration so much more fun for you. Also, it's gonna be way more functional. You can carry stuff around on your water bottle. Just try it out, it's not that expensive. It is a great way to use one water bottle and give it a lot of love. So if you have a water bottle that you're like, eh, I kind of like, Spice it up with some charge harms. It's a great gift for someone. So if you're like, oh, I don't know if I'll use it, but maybe my sister will use it, maybe my grandma will use it, maybe my mom will use it. Definitely an awesome present and Christmas is right around the corner. No matter what, charge harms is something you should absolutely try out if you haven't already. And if you have any questions, comments, or concerns, absolutely let me know in the comments below. I will respond to everyone, unless it's like really creepy then I'm not gonna respond. But if you have a legitimate comment, question, or concern, I am absolutely going to respond to you. Make sure to click subscribe, turn on post notifications, follow our channel, and follow us on Instagram at chargearms underscore and then follow us on TikTok at chartarms underscore underscore. We're also on Pinterest if you're a Pinterest gal. We're on Tumblr if you're a Tumblr gal. But anyways, you guys, follow us on everything. There's gonna be lots of new updates coming and new projects coming. And there will be another YouTube video in one week. Comment what you would like to see in a YouTube video. I will say, the next YouTube video, I am planning on it being an HQ tour. So stay tuned for next week, you guys. Cheers.